god. What in God's name is this? <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> He's yes! my favorite. Oh my god. Doja Cat. I don't know what I'm watching. This is so weird. It's okay. Yo. <laughs> oh my god, the anime things are freaking me out. These are great. Bitch, I'm a what? I'm not in the f She's one of my favorites too. I'm. Why am I wearing this shirt today? Yeah. Oh why God, is he? Matching. <laughs> Everyone's matching. Ooh, oh, it's a mood. I like kind of like it, but I also really hate it. I'm not in the mood. As you should. I'm not really looking for anything other than like people to laugh at it and like enjoy it. And some people kind of overanalyze it, and I do that too myself. That's gonna happen naturally, so I understand when people do that. You're like, this is deep. It's a political message. That, like, what he just said. This like can't be a thing. This some people think, real. I know he was joking, but like, some people <laughs> think it's like some political so message. This is a weird good shit. Like, I wasn't expecting this to just be a weird shit. This That's weird what I'm saying. Shit. I want it to be weird and good. I don't understand if this is like a vegan statement. It's not. It's about the government. Or if it's just like, oh, it's about the Illuminati. And pieces from <laughs> Yeah. Treat you. But I have to try my oh milkshake. My God, How long is this video? Forever. <laughs> I want a cheeseburger. <laughs> this is so good, dude. He's so it's cute. Just such, it's just such mean music. This is dumb. And sometimes dumb things are funny. It's yes. not bad. It's really good. From yeah. beginning to end, everything. The lyrics, the outfit. The visuals, Thanks. the background. Thank you. That was the best weird shit. Thanks. Seen Thanks, babe. So that was the viral hit, Moo. <laughs> <laughs> was that you <laughs> saying that? Yes, that was me. Moo. <laughs> I love the enthusiasm. <laughs> she looks so like. In this video, she'll be breaking down her lips. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She did it on a Genius. The second that dropped, I had to watch. This top was like a huge distraction for me. I would like go to hit the keys on the keyboard and like I had <laughs> in my way. Like I literally can't, I can't function with this. And I'm just like hitting the keys and I'm like, you know what? She's so cute. I'm just gonna make Thanks. a song about cows. Me too. <laughs> it's kind of a break for everybody. I feel like artists have been taking themselves really serious. I agree with this too. Climate. Everything's like very right sensitive and like- I will say it. like the whole like people and- <sighs> I'm gonna get like a little bit in trouble, but I don't really care. There's been this trend of like putting a throne and like sitting on a throne in music videos, and it's so tacky to me. It just shows like the whole, the narcissism of it all, and like how much people like are obsessed with themselves and their music. And, and that's what I wanted with this. I just wanted people to like know like, hey, you don't have to make music about how you the best. You know, like it doesn't it doesn't matter. Like have fun. The climate right now is kind of like it's kind of uptight. Everyone's pretty yeah. sensitive right now. I think people do need humor. That's like, true. If I'm making fun, <laughs> yeah. I love how she comes to her senses. My name is Doja Cat. I gotta acknowledge that. Don't if give I'm in. The song, I mean, it's true. <laughs> got B. Can she do some like they ASMR know. videos, please? Her if anyone make her voice is so. Soothing. I think anyone makes a count. What do you think I've, of that? I've felt, I've felt that before. I feel like I should maybe do some sort of radio talk, like, you know, type thing. But, uh, I'll get bored. I love that she has an In-N-Out burger in her hand. One, South I didn't even eat it. It got cold. That burger was like, it was stale as by the end of that interview. I got a cheeseburger. <laughs> vegan. I don't hate vegans. I just don't give a that you're vegan, stop. Oh my God. <laughs> Why is that funny to me? I don't we all feel that way. Oh my God. As stupid as this whole thing was, is there a brilliance to it? Yeah. Because do you have any idea how much money she made <laughs> from this stupid thing? And she's like this. <laughs> I'm off to the bank. Yes! She's so like, the way she talks, it's like, it's like profound. I just like the things that she has to say that hit me right here. They were so cute and so like fun to watch. Some of them will stick with me for, for a while. Like, uh, it's just nice to see people, you know, relate 
and or or kind of get it. You can read like Instagram comments all day, and it's kind of all the same thing. Like it's different when you see someone react, like someone emote and like open up in that way. Doja Cat, first of all, it's great to have you here. What was it like kind of taking a trip down memory lane to see the adults reacting to Bitch I'm a Cow? I've seen it a couple times. I love that video and I just think it's it's really cool uh, to see people's reactions. I think I've watched probably every single reaction to that video. Some of them are really bad. When you first released Moo, it quickly went viral, was everywhere online. Uh, ever, you know, a lot of people talking about it. There's a lot of buzz. What were you thinking, like, when this started to go viral? When you started to see the kind of the numbers tick up? It's, it's, uh, it was wild. I thought it was really cool because it felt like, okay, people are on board with my sense of humor. There was some, uh, some uh, interesting remakes. There were some really good ones. Um, there were some really, really cute ones. Uh, on Instagram too. And I, I made sure I'd repost most of them. What's something like people tend to not know or like realize when you go viral in this way? What do you think is something that people miss? A lot of people don't prepare for negative stuff, like negative uh, feedback. Um, I, I strongly recommend it because, you know, it is hard, it, it, it does hurt. It's, you know, there's people out there who just don't, they don't really, they use it as a as a weapon instead of a tool. In general, like how do you see social media and meme culture like affecting the music industry moving forward? Um I feel like it is so big right now and you know, people like to write about their lives and like reference things that they know and a lot of people my age just know memes. So I think, yeah, there's gonna be a lot more meme music coming out for sure. We actually have a new song of yours, so we'd love to have you listen to it here and talk us through some of it. So I'm reacting to my video? Yeah. Sick. Ooh, look at all that. I never seen this before. Holy sh I love this video. Shout out to Roxana. Such a cool shot. I love it. I feel like nobody's ever really done the Lisa Frank vibe, and I feel like we like killed it. It's crazy how fast we did this too. Like it was so, it was like bang, like next look, next look, like take your nails off, put your nails on, like so many just things like flying around all the time. Like we had nails falling off. Like it was just crazy. We did all this in one day and there were like three or four other looks that we didn't use. They said, Rico, you so nasty. I said, thank you very much. Yeah. He just want to eat me like some candy, but I'm not his buttercup. <laughs> She killed this verse. I had people who knew other people and uh, and just, you know, they linked us through kind of that way. And I didn't know Rico or anything like that personally, but we just knew she was the perfect person for this. Here it comes. My chopper sing like Sia. Make a bitch sick, diarrhea. But um, the girl in the front driving the lift is the director. That's Roxana. My twins big like Tia. My twins big. And those wigs were crazy. I wanted to move more, but like, I didn't want to mess up the wigs because they were so beautiful. So I get a lot of like comparisons to Tamara Maori. Uh, more so than Tia. I would just get it so much that I'm like, F it, why not? I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use that to my advantage. They have heard it. They, they commented on my Instagram, both of them. Uh, Tia commented first. She said, I, I listen to this. I'm listening to this while I'm, while pumping. And at first I didn't know what that meant. I'm like, oh, you're at the gym. <laughs> like you're pumping iron, but she was talking about like pumping her her breast for her baby. That's so tight. But yeah, I got that and then I didn't know what to say. So I was like, 
I'm basically crying right now is what I said back to her. So finally, you were able to hear what the adults thought about you and your music. So we wanted to see if there was anything you wanted to say back to them. I think you guys are really sweet and really cute and I love you and I appreciate your reaction. And I'm gonna keep watching that video from time to time. Thanks. Thanks FB for having me. Check out my music and check me out on tour.